Hello everyone and welcome to Exhibit. My name is Pratik. You know what you've clicked on and today we have with us the Samsung Galaxy S21 FE. Now, there has been a shift in the Indian smartphone buyer market. People already use good phones but are now looking for better phones for future use. What was earlier considered as a price sensitive market is now opting for phones well above the 25,000 price bracket. Samsung achieved a lot of success with the S20 FE, selling over 10 million units globally and still continuing to do so. Now, does the Samsung Galaxy S21 FE pick up the banter where the earlier champ left it? Or how exactly does it fare? Today we go and find out. Let's unbox the Galaxy S21 FE. As you can see, the entire packaging is pretty slim along with One UI elements and S21 embossed on the box. And this S denotes that we have a lavender unit with us. Up front, you're greeted with the physical phone itself. We'll look at this later. Inside the box, you do not get much. You only get a SIM ejector pin along with a type C cable. Now, as you can see, this is a very beautiful color. This comes in a light lavender unit that we have here. Let's take a physical overview of how exactly this phone is. Phone first of all feels very light in your hand. It's at 177 grams. It also feels premium in hand. Now coming to the right hand side, you have a power button along with volume rocker and antenna band over here. Up top, there's a secondary microphone along with another antenna band. The left is pretty clean with just one antenna band over here. And at the bottom, you have a speaker grill, USB Type-C, your SIM card port and two other antenna bands that you can see. Let's go ahead and take a look at the SIM configuration of the Galaxy S21 FE 5G. As you can see here, you do not get any micro SD expansion, but you get dual SIM slots on either ends. The S21 FE also sports a triple camera setup, just like the S21. Now the difference here being that the ultra wide sensor is a 12 megapixel. The normal primary sensor comes with OIS. It is also 12 megapixel. And unlike the normal S21, the S21 FE gets an 8 megapixel telephoto lens with OIS. You also have a 32 megapixel front facing camera. Coming to the display of this device. now. On the front, we have a 6.4 inch Infinity O display with dynamic AMOLED 2X display, which features 120 Hz of refresh rate and 240 Hz of sampling, touch sampling rate. What is different than the normal S21 is that the normal S21 has a 6.2 inch display and this one comes with a 6.4 inch display. You also have minimal bezels and it's good for multimedia users. Now, Samsung has not skimped on the protection of this device and given it a Gorilla Glass Victus protection up front. Now this phone also comes with IP68 water and dust resistance, just like its expensive siblings do. Now the display is supposed to get 1200 nits of peak brightness on HDR and 700 nits on normal usage. Out of the box, this phone comes loaded with 120Hz screen refresh rate for buttery smooth operations. That said, this also runs Samsung's One UI on Android 12. Also, unlike the Galaxy S21, which comes with an ultrasonic fingerprint reader, this is an optical reader, but still plenty fast enough. This phone comes along with a single speaker unit and the earpiece doubles up as the stereo speaker when you play something. Now an upgrade from the S21, the S21 FE 5G gets 4500 mAh of battery. It also supports 25 watt of fast charging and despite a plastic bag, it's a polycarbonate unit, you also get reverse wireless charging of up to 15 watts for your buds or something else that you wish to charge. Samsung also promises 3 years of software and security updates to the Galaxy S21 FE 5G. 
the Galaxy S21 comes powered by a Exynos 2100 5 nanometer processor, also seen in the normal Galaxy S21. The Galaxy S21 FE 5G looks, feels, and even performs like the S21, but at a lower price. Now, stay tuned for a complete review with camera samples, gaming performance, battery life, and much more. This phone also comes in four colors. There's black, there's white, there's olive, and there's this beautiful lavender color. Which one is your favorite? And what do you think about this phone? Let us know in the comment section below. For more such videos, subscribe and stay tuned for the full review of the Samsung Galaxy S21 FE 5G.